Really freaking out. Oh. All right, you ready to do this? Okay. We're going to a nice hotel, and that's what you're wearing? Well, I'm going on the cover. This is what my character's wearing. Well, you look like a guy who's about to get whacked on the Sopranos. Wait, 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 wait. No, 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 no. He looks like Missy Elliott. Yes! <laughs> yes! Yes! <laughs> Next year, they step into the spotlight. The Winter Olympics on NBC. Welcome back to Miss USA. Now, before we crown a new winner, it's only appropriate to honor the reigning Miss USA. A year ago, Deshauna Barber became the 65th Miss USA. She has carried the crown with class and grace. She spent the last year working as a powerful voice for positive change and has demonstrated true strength through adversity. Happy Mother's Day, everyone. It has been an amazing year and incredibly life-changing, but it has been very bittersweet for me because three months after I was crowned Miss USA, I lost my mother to lung cancer. She was a wonderful woman, and this day is very hard. Um, she was my best friend, and I'm happy that I won Miss USA and she was able to see that. I have an afro, she has an afro. So she really wanted me to wear my afro on stage. So today, during my final walk, I will be wearing my afro as a tribute to her. So mom, this is for you. It was an honor to be the first active military soldier to win Miss USA. First, I want to thank my angel in heaven, my mother. Your spirit is always with me. To my dad, Lavette, and my siblings, you are all the reason I am Miss USA. To Miss Carla, the Miss DC USA family, and the Miss Universe organization, Emily, Esther, and Paula, your guidance has molded me over the course of my reign. To Catherine, Pia, Carly, and Iris, I love you, my dear sister queens. And to Miss USA 2017, you are worthy and you will now represent the women of the United States. Thank you, Deshauna. It's been an incredible year, and now it's time to pass the crown to another extraordinary woman. 51 amazing women lit up the stage tonight, and now three of them stand within reach of the title. Each of them shining examples of strength, beauty, confidence, and an unwavering drive to follow their dreams. It's time to reveal the next Miss USA. Tall Goldhammer from the accounting firm Ernst & Young has tabulated the votes. Thank you. Whew. Here we go. The judges have cast their votes, and viewers everywhere have weighed in. All of the hard work, all of their tireless preparation, rounds after rounds of competition, it's all led to this very moment. Good luck to all of you. <laughs> the second runner-up, for Miss USA 2017 is... Minnesota! <laughs> 
two women remain, District of Columbia and New Jersey, please take center stage. One of you is moments away from becoming the next Miss USA. Now, for any reason, the winner is unable to fulfill her duties. The runner-up will take her place. Good luck to you both. Miss USA 2017 is District of Columbia! We have a new Miss USA! Thank you all! Good night! Good night! Good night, Good night everybody! Good night, guys! Wow! <laughs> Hello? Look out, she's right behind you. I told you I was gonna get you, and I never break a promise. How do you have Chris's phone? I took it, just before I killed her. How slow are you? You killed Chris? And that Tanya bitch, and that idiot Paul if he'll only hurry up and die already, and now you. Why? Because Justin Miller is mine. <laughs> He loves me, and nobody will get in the way of our love. Nobody. Fuck you. Get your kids to eat fruit every day. Show them a fun, silly way to do it. 
take an orange. Not only does it give them their daily dose of vitamin C, it can also provide their daily dose of fun. The more you know. take your husband away to a hotel for the weekend? Oh, good. Get him out of here. <laughs> Come on in. Oy. Let me guess. He is not ready. No, of course not. Right. You know what? Just pretending to be his wife gives me ajuda. How you do it for real, I 